Hello, everyone. Welcome into the Market Scale Studios. I'm your host today, Tyler Kern. And we're living in an uncertain time with the coronavirus and with everything going on in the wake of that. But business continues to move. And today we're getting an update from Tamlin, from Ian Daniels, the Director of Architectural Products at Tamlin. And he's going to tell us a little bit more about Tamlin's efforts as far as coronavirus are concerned, how they're helping the community at large when it comes to public health, and then give us an update on their flagship product, the Extreme, the Extreme Trim product line as well. So Ian, thank you so much for joining me today. Hey, thanks, Tyler. Thanks for having me. Super excited to be here, and hopefully everybody's being safe and taking precautions. So. Exactly. Wash those hands, everybody. <laughs> right. Stay at home. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, Ian, just give me an idea of what Tamlin is doing just to keep business moving as best possible during this coronavirus outbreak. Right. So we're kind of taking it in a twofold approach. Um, for our outside sales team and our outside guys, what we're doing is – Obviously, a lot of video, lunch and learns, video conferencing, uh, PKs, things like that via Zoom, Skype, anything you can come up with, right? So as much as we can. Uh, other thing we're doing is we're pushing to create some, you know, kind of simple assets and, you know, uh, maybe PowerPoint presentations that we've given as outside guys that we can provide to our distributing partners and our dealer partners that then they can kind of just click through at their own leisure and kind of learn about the product line. So we've been working those two. And then at our home base back in Houston, what we're doing, which is uh, pretty cool, we've taken as many, uh, not non-essentials, but as many people as we can uh, that can work from home. We've had them work from home, setting them up with their computers, uh, laptops, whatever we need. Uh, that includes kind of our estimating department, a number of our technical people, um, some of our marketing team, guys like that. Um, and what's that allowed us to do is that at home base, we're able to separate our operations and our sales teams kind of apart from each other. Uh, getting that good six foot distance as much as we can, if not more, uh, disinfecting the workspace as often as we can. And so that way they can continue to be on the phones. We can continue to assist our customers and keep the ball rolling as best we can. Yeah. And I know that Tamlin as a company really values that ability to be able to travel around the country, get in front of potential clients and prospective customers and things like that. How have you found Zoom and other technologies to be effective means of uh, still being able to communicate, still being able to get in front of people and educate people on what Tamlin products are all about? Um, so far, it's been really good. Uh, we're just kind of jumping into doing it um, AIA level at like architecture offices and things like that. We have done some kind of one-on-ones with firms and things like that. Um, but a great story, we had uh, one of our, our Southeast rep, uh, Josh Godkin, went out and uh, did a Zoom meeting and closed a uh, builder for us. So, you know, it's obviously still working. Uh, and for, we're all just kind of adapting and making it work as best we can. So it's still been a very effective tool for us. And I think, you know, we're as connected as we can be. Absolutely. Now, your efforts uh, to keep business moving uh, don't just stay with your regular product line. You've actually evolved a little bit and you're doing some efforts and making some efforts to help with public health as well during the coronavirus outbreak. Tell me a little bit more about those efforts and, and what Tamlin is doing uh, in partnering with the community to, uh, to do a little bit to help protect people. Right. So our group down there in Houston has done a great job. Uh, they actually found a local uh, partner. Uh, the company is called Patty, P-A-T-Y, Inc. Uh, they, are, they make infant clothing and child clothing and child apparel. Uh, they've been around since 1955. So very long, you know, similar to us, very long standing, very committed to the community. Um, and what we've done is we've taken our WRBs, our water resistive or weather resistive barrier, our commercial wrap, and donated that to them because it's a product that can be used to create medical and PPE style masks uh, to hold out that moisture, things like that. And so they've started to develop uh, sewing them together and putting out masks. So they're going to distribute there and kind of the Houston market. And then our goal is if we can ramp it up a little bit, if we can have them produce some that our guys can take to job sites in other parts of the country where we're continuing to do work where, you know, those guys and everybody can use it as much as possible. Absolutely. That's that's really fantastic to hear just a little bit more about those efforts and how uh, Tamlin as a company values the community, you value the area where you're located. And so making those partnerships and having the ability to be flexible in that way really does speak to the way that Tamlin values other people and takes public health seriously. Right. It's it's pretty exciting. And to be a member of the company, it, it, it kind of lifts your spirits a little bit when you say, hey, let's, let's, let's think about this in an outside the box way and let's all fight 
everything. Let's not just worry about our bottom dollar. So I think that's important. Absolutely. Absolutely. Well, let's finish off just talking a little bit more about Tamlin's flagship product. Uh, that is the Extreme Trim product line um, and what's going on with that. So give me an update on what's going on with Extreme Trim moving forward and uh, what's the current state of the product? Um, well, uh, this hasn't slowed down. Uh, <laughs> actually, it's uh, probably allowed us to ramp it up a little bit. Um, it's given some of our guys some time to sit back, think about new profiles, um, start creating new profiles. Um, it's also enabled some, uh, like you said, some business to business partnerships to come back into the realm where you can get to kind of really hammer those detail out where, you know, we're not all running in 50 million different directions. We can center a little bit. So that's been good. We've done some Cool business to business there. Really exciting thing for us is we've done some new two-piece profiles. Um, we've brought a new outside corner to the market, which is a, what we call a reveal style corner. Um, and then we've also brought a low profile inside corner, which are two very unique profiles to the market, uh, which we think will uh, help some guys kind of ease their way into using this product because uh, we're starting to see it more more scales, right? So it used to just be very large, multifamily, larger commercial projects. Now yeah. we're starting to see it trickle and work its way down to townhomes, uh, single family as accent pieces, things like that. And some of the guys working at that level aren't quite as, you know, they're not as knowledgeable with it. They haven't worked with it a ton. So some of these two piece, they can kind of intermix it with some of the other one piece and it helps make the tricky pieces that the guys already in the field know how to do that have been working with it for a long time but these guys it makes that tricky part a little bit easier so yeah that's uh that's the big part and then obviously uh we never stop expanding same thing with our other lines we've continued to add stuff with our extreme interior and our moisture management stuff's expanding every day they so they keep throwing new things at us which is really exciting <laughs> so well, you know, still innovating, still expanding, still growing, even yep. though all of this is happening. Truly, you know, Tamlin, B2B business just never sleeps. And so uh, so yep. it's, it's good to hear that business is still going well and that you're still able to move forward and innovate even during this time. Right. And I think, you know, and I think that's the whole thing. We all kind of, it, it is scary, right? It's definitely a scary time, but it's also a time you, you, you've got a little more time. You can sit back and reflect and say, okay, what, you know, what can I change? What can I do next? Maybe what is my next big thing? Or right. how do I improve upon what I already have? So I think we're all exploring it from different angles. And I think it's, uh, you know, plus same thing on the family side, you get to spend more time with family. You know, you, we get to do some reconnecting that maybe not some of us haven't got to do for a while because we've all been running, gunning, and been on our phones too much. So Right, right. Well, it's a valuable time to reset and to, you know, reset priorities and make sure that you're all still pulling and moving in the same direction. And so I think that there is value in that and value in being able to do that as a company. For sure. For sure. That's that's one of the, the greatest things we're seeing is, hey, let's let's uh, let's get the rope back off onto the same spot. So we're all working the same rope. Definitely. Yeah, that's that's really good to hear. Well, uh, Ian Daniels, Director of Architectural Products for Tamlin, thank you so much for joining me, providing an update on how business is going during coronavirus and telling us a little bit more about some of those efforts in the community, creating masks and PPE for, uh, for people out there uh, just to keep people safe. So, Ian, thank you so much for joining me today. Oh, no, thank you for having me. And if anybody needs any other information, just visit us at tamlin.com. And uh, it's got our rep finders and everything else. We're always here to help as much as we can. Absolutely. So. That's Tamlin.com, T-A-M-L-Y-N.com. Make sure to go visit and uh, find out more information there. Thank you. Appreciate it, guys. Have a great safe day, everyone.